I'm Jessica Jewell and this is your 10 News Update. Atlanta residents are helping clean up the Wendy's restaurant that was burned down Saturday following the death of Rayshard Brooks. Brooks was shot and killed by police in the restaurant's parking lot Friday night after authorities say he pointed a taser at an officer as he ran away from them. The Wendy's was engulfed in flames the following night after a day of protests in the area. Calls are growing for an investigation into the hanging death of a black man in California. Robert Fuller's body was found in a tree early Wednesday morning. Activists want to know what happened to Fuller, and the Los Angeles Urban Policy Roundtable is among them. The group's president says they aren't rushing to judgment, but the organization is formally asking the FBI and Justice Department to look into the death. Local investigators initially determined Fuller had committed suicide. Virginia's 5,000-man march brought thousands of people from all over to Richmond Saturday to rally against police brutality. In the streets of what was once the capital of the Confederacy, thousands of peaceful marchers gathered to make their voices heard. It started at the Lee Monument. The event had many speakers from different groups to unite and ignite change. The march ended with a speech from George Floyd's cousin. A reminder, you can get updates on the go with WSLS.com and the 10 News app. I'm Jessica Jewell, 10 News, working for you.